We say every story, every word has its time to be told. And when it's ready to be told, it will be told. So now is the time for us to tell the story of Kanikuria. Imama nevo wole yambi anbe adena mo kende almusuba kende almoba kende. We are here today with my sister, Sister Rashida Ismaili. We want to remember, want to remember the ancestors. But today, the ancestors. I have a name. The name is Kani Kuria. We want to call your name because names do not die. Names do not rust. Names do not rot. Granny Kani Kuria. This is me, Kibule Kamara, son of Kitasana, son of Tadi Linseni, son of Bambayenka, your daughter. Today we are here to remember you and all of the ancestors. So this water that I'm pouring today with my sister Rashida Ismaili, what do we want it for? We want it for you to guide us today to be able to tell your story. Okay. This is my friend. Yeah? Yeah? No? Yes. Yeah, tell them, tell them, tell them. Tell them. Yeah. 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 I'm his best friend. Yes. Kanikuria went to the, the stream 
at the edge of the mania. The morning dew started clearing up. People did not see Kanikuria return. We tell the story of this woman, young woman. She was about 16 or 17 and uh, she went every day with the other girls to um, to a specific uh, river to get fresh water and also um, they, they would uh, bathe and wash clothes, etc. And this particular day, she got up early as she normally would do, went to fetch water and never came back and no one ever saw her. And, and so it was, it, um, people said that uh, she was taken in the, in the slave trade. When you leave that, that, when you take all of these people behind, we always talk about that, that there was devastation in Africa. That was David, but what, how did that manifest in people's actual lives? What are the stories that told, that talk about what happens when somebody like Kani Kuria gets stolen? That story of those communities, the actual effect of the slave trade on those communities, and the destruction of civilization, of people's lives, etc., that is what's not that well documented. That's the, the African side of it. The African, well, both, they're both African side, but the, the, the side that's left behind, the, the side of the continent itself, on the land of the continent. It's hard to find the documentation as to the impact that the slave trade had directly on individual communities and peoples and stuff like that. That was not that documented. Come on. Come on. So Kanikura never showed up when the sun rose up. So they sent up a party to look for Kanikuria everywhere. Everywhere they searched. Everywhere they searched. In the forest, in the mountains. Normally Kanikuria, somebody will answer back. But the echo of just went through the mountains, through the forest, and no reply. Kanikuria could not be heard. The day passed. The night came. Kanikuria was nowhere to be found. But they knew. But they knew. Everyone knew. There were witnesses. There are witnesses. Witnesses that people don't recognize. The forest is a witness, the grass is a witness, the tree is a witness, the animals in the bush are witnesses. They are witnesses. Somebody, some spirit, saw a panicuria. And the people know that that panicuria, the people know panicuria that is in that stream. That stream, my friends, is a very special stream. That's a, a black rock there. That rock, people are still talking about it. They don't know where it came from. It could have been a meteorite. There's nothing like it anywhere, but that rock is there. What did they find? They found the waste beads of Kanikuria on this rock and the clothes that Kanikuria had on this, this rock. So Kanikuria is here. 
kuya is here. How could she be? How could she be? You don't know how to process, I guess is the word. You don't know how to process it because one minute they were here in this in this space. Yes. The next minute that space is is empty, is blank. What happened to that to that to that person that was there? Where and the energy of that person, you know, kind of remains remains there. So when you doing this, when you when you calling on them, you really are uh, calling on this energy of this of 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 this of this person, this missing person, um, to 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 come and inhabit that space. My mind says, if Kanikuria is the grandmother of my grandfather, most probably she lived in the early 1800s, the first half of the 1800s. What was happening then? Young women in particular, young men, young women, but particularly young women were disappearing in Africa. Why? Something had happened in the world. Something dynamic had happened in the world that changed, seemed to change everything. Just a few years earlier, there had been what you call the invasion of the cotton gene in America. And that invention of the cotton gene, as everybody knows, created a lot of demand for labor. But guess what? We all know there are people in here, like Mr. Jefferson, whose slaves were his own children. How did they do that? Well, they created a domestic market. They brought young women and got them pregnant to create slaves for themselves. Kanikuria, Kanikuria, could have landed here during the reign of King Cotton. The cotton that made America famous and powerful. The cotton and the rice, all of them produced by people like Kanikuria in West Africa. That's what it's about. When Europeans came, they worked with people. They collaborated with people. Those people are there, yeah. Europeans control the slave trade, they control the ships, they control the manufacturing, they control the guns, they control the plantation, they manage the, the, the global slave trade. But on a macro, micro level, there are, a local level, there are people involved in it. Those people may not be ready to tell the story of their own involvement. Or sometimes, People who are victims of, 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 of victims, just like people are victims of rape, the rapist, the, 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 the victim of rape is sometimes the least person ready to talk about rape. So if you think about it, that in the, the situation in that way, Africa was raped. So Africa, what happened to Africa there must be told. Taking other people, raising their own children, getting children with them, and enslaving those people, and creating one broad rule, one drop of broad rule, so they can enslave their own children. That's what we're talking about. So I know if Kamikuya, if Kamikuya came on this side, probably her children are all over the place. Her children. Some of them may be passing for white now. Many of them will be black, or they will be here just like many, many sisters 
came here and got children. But that's not what our people tell me. What our people say. When somebody dies, when they die, you make a shrine. And what's that shrine for? That shrine is not for you to remember the pain. That shrine is for you to take the pain and twist it like a blacksmith will twist an iron and make a chain that somebody can wear that becomes decorative. That's what they make it out of it. So the people of Damania, the Kamara people, what did they do? They created, they said, Kanikuria lives in this forest. This forest is a sanctuary for spirits. This forest is a sanctuary for animals. It's a sanctuary for plants. Nobody cuts down a tree there. Nobody kills an animal. If anything, before you go, when you want to call the name of Kanikuria, you bring your fruits, you bring your water, you give it to the inhabitants of Kanikuria because now the forest became Kanikuria. So I, I grew up in Cotonou about um, half an hour from the from the border of the city of Wida. Wida was very infamous um, um, a slave fortress. Um, and we had a day of remembrance um, that we observed every year. Daddy! That's where the ancestors are. Yeah. You, you left the plate there and you say, you know, maybe as if the person will come and just eat it. But then at the end, we had this way of saying, ha, ah, but they never came back. And so when they never come back, then that means that they really were taken, that they really are gone. What do we say? If you know, like I do, that your story is a story of Kanikuria, you are the child of Kanikuria. You can come to this group. You can come here. You can pour libation. You can pray. You can call the ancestors. You can call those who you know. You can call those who you don't know. You can say, you can pour libation to the seen and unseen in Kanikuria. Kanikuria leaves. Damania! Damania, Damania, Damania. together that's a very sacred time. We are the village that you left and the village that you look over and the village that you come from and we are grateful for you. We hope that wherever you are that you are in peace and that you are pleased with us and if we're doing something that we shouldn't do come to us in a dream and show us what we should do. May we honor you. May we never forget you. And don't forget us. Amen. 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 
club. It's three. Yesterday is past. We are in today. Nobody know tomorrow. The story is told. Thank you. Kelefa Bar. <laughs>